Hey YouTube, I'm back. Um, this is the my son's Tesla, and this is mine. So I'm coming back um, to my previous episode, the episode where I explained that after a software update, something uh, strange happened or something changed in the behavior of autopilot, and especially on highways. I demonstrated uh, a few things, but uh, I was wrong when I said that I seem to have lost the uh, navigate on autopilot, the single blue line. Um, actually, somebody who watched my episode made the remark that I didn't uh, plan a destination. So automatically the single line will not appear. So. I tried it again and you will see that uh, there are some very positive changes in the behavior. So we are coming closer to FSD in Europe. Okay, watch it and like it and subscribe if you want to see my next episode. Bye bye. This is the reaction of Leonard Freeberg. Uh, he was actually the first one who remarked this and, and posted it on X. So he said, yes, uh, I didn't see a planning destination. So I'm doing a test here on a very busy highway in, in peak hours in the evening. And uh, I will show with labels like now what I'm doing, engaging autopilot, then blinking left, blinking right and changing lanes. So. Without further ado, let's just watch the short demonstration and you'll see what happens. So, uh, remark the way that I hold my steering wheel. Actually, I don't hold it. I just put my thumb and index finger around it without even touching it. So it's like a capacitive uh, impression that I have of it. Um, it's actually not capacitive, but you don't need to put a torque on the steering wheel. But what happens is that the camera is probably watching my hand and it should be holding the steering wheel. So by doing this, it is no effort. I put my hand on my knee and I just put my fingers around it. And you will see during three minutes now, uh, there is no nagging anymore. So the camera is doing its job of monitoring what I'm doing. Uh, it's a bit boring this part, I know, but just uh, watch it, how it works. And it, you will remark the difference with uh, the situation before this update.
Yeah, from here you will see a few demonstrations of uh, changing lanes, auto lane changes this time. Uh, I only touch the blinkers to the left and then the car immediately moves without actually giving some steering input. Okay, and then when I passed the cars that I'm overtaking, uh, I just need to press the blinkers to the right and then you will see that I just hold the steering and that it will initiate the maneuver by itself. So I'm not sure if this is already uh, a system initiated maneuver, actually it is, but uh, actually I gave the signal with the blinkers that it should go, but I don't touch the steering anymore. And that's a big change compared to before. Now you will see again, I'm going to pass the next car, blink left. Okay, I don't actually touch the steering, I just pretend to hold the steering. My hand is near. And then I can pass the cars on the second lane. And this I find really much more relaxing than before because those maneuvers, they did not always work well in the past. So now it is very relaxing and I'm enjoying to ride with it.
I hope you liked this short demo and uh, if you like it, please subscribe to my channel and come back. I will uh, continue to report what's happening with FSD in Europe. Bye bye.